had, we just made it to Seattle and I had a feeling that I was gonna love this place. We've been here for about an hour. And I was right. I fucking love it. to Capitol Cider on Pike Street, Capitol Hill, which supposedly is the area that everything's popping down here. So we're gonna go drink some cider. And more importantly, we're gonna go eat some food because it is 1434. Oh, there's dogs. Look at the donkeys. All right, she'll be here for another half hour. And we haven't really eaten today, so we are hungry and uh, we are on the hunt for some food now and drinks. Supposedly this place has a lot of good cider and beers. I'm hearing that there's a lot of good beers here. Oh my God, Ro, oh my God. Rome hates pigeons. <laughs> oh, pigeon watch. <laughs> How you doing? Uh, hi, V. So a quick little audible, uh, Capital Cider is not open for dinner until five and it's two, despite how it feels like five. So we're going to a place called Plum Bistro. It's a vegan spot and it's close by. We just need to get food, man. And then we can just start drinking and droning and whatever else we want to do here. Dip it in some sugar and raw rhubarb. Cheers. Cheers. All right, we got to uh, Plum and we just ordered our food. Rome ordered this French dip and she was so excited about it because she hasn't had a French dip in forever. And then they were like, no, we're out of it. And then she got so upset and then they come back like, no, we're not. So Rome's feeling a lot of feelings right now. I'm pretty starving and I ordered a ton of food. So we'll be, we'll be getting our grub on right now. A lot of food. Do we? You did, but it's good. I ordered pizza and mac and cheese. <laughs> so if you want to eat some of them for me. We just got to put the drone up, which was actually a lot of fun, but we had like a sort of a pre-dinner. The dinner wasn't that big. It was delicious, but we're probably going to eat some more in a bit. The Goyles are doing some Goyle shopping in here because Rome found a David Bowie jacket. And yeah, we're just walking around Seattle exploring and having a blast. I love it here. The food's delicious. Everyone's so fucking nice here. I love when I come to a place. That's how I felt the first time I came to Austin. Everyone was so nice. And that's the vibe I'm getting from Seattle, which is a really, really cool thing. I've seen signs like that uh, on a lot of different establishments so far in Seattle. And that is something that I like. I feel like it's interesting that they're specifying that on the outside of their business so as to be like, no fucking dickheads in here. It's cool though. I've never seen that in another city where multiple establishments have that sign or a sign similar to that out on the front. Kind of a, I feel like a good representation of uh, Seattle. Can we go to bait? Yeah. We we, oh yeah, that looks cool in there. We're gonna go to bait now. Not debate, we're going to bait. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Me and your friends. Oh my god, that's so, so cute. cute. I love you. <laughs> I love. He's like hugging. You like hugs? Oh, thank you. I love hugs. Oh, I'm like gonna cry. I needed a puppy hug so bad. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. He's so wow, sweet. We just got here. We're visiting Los Angeles. Yeah. He's like an angel. He's so funny how he like hugs. My God, he does. He does the full blown hug. Wow, thank you, bud. Oh, you gotta live your life now, bud. You know? You're adorable. Nice. What are you doing? Huh? He's staring at the camera. Are you looking at the camera? Grandpa wants to 
really will stop out. staring at you. It's because he's trying to. And it was this one, right? Yeah. Oh. He's waiting. You trying to get my leg in there? What'd you get? Got some pins. Oh, that is so like cool. Yeah. Can we leave? Or Last leave? hugs. Last hug. hug. Oh my god. Can you believe this? Okay. I've never seen a dog do that. It's so cute. We're gonna leave you alone. Okay, bye. Bye, Rambo. Stay with you, bye. 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 Thank you. Bye, Rambo. Oh, he's the cutest. Oh, here he comes. <laughs> here he comes. Bye, he's coming. Rambo, you gotta stay, bud. Bye, Rambo. I'm sorry. Bye, Rambo. He's like, why? Bye, bud. So oh, sad. my god. <laughs> I, I can't believe how affectionate he was with that you. That was so fucking cute, man. Are <laughs> you sad? He knew I needed a dog hug and he was giving me He one. gave you like the Kermit style hug, which I've never seen another dog do. Right? That was wild. He's like such a big head. Yeah. Like, the most endearing thing I've oh, like, ever seen. Oh, that, that dog was downright adorable. Alright, let's get another shot, yeah? <laughs> you just want to sit here and face the wall? Yeah. Tight. We want the whole restaurant to be. <laughs> Alright, we found some shuffleboard at this bar, so we're gonna play shuffleboard. Alright, so Jenna just schooled both myself and Rome in shuffleboard. She's good, she's got the touch. This game is fun, but sometimes it's confusing because the puck, or I don't know what you call it, will catch a bunch of dust and will slow down, and other times it'll just catch raw table and go flying, so it's hard, but it's fun. Jenna just completely totaled both of us. We are having an absolutely amazing time in Seattle. We've been here just a few hours, and we already, all three of us collectively love the place. I can't say enough good things about here. I knew I would like it, but I really like it. One other thing, I was showing Rome and Jenna some of my old Snapchat art. I was showing her this, and for whatever reason, Rome and Jenna don't believe that I did that. They don't think I can draw at all or on Snapchat. Can you help me convince them that I can do that and that I did do that? Because it's annoying. What the fuck, man? All right, so we just left that last bar, and we had a great time. It was really fun. Uh, but I left my ID at the bar because we were playing shuffleboard. I had to leave my ID, so I'm going back to get it. Rome and Jenna went to get a lane at the bowling alley because we were going to go bowling. But first I got to get my license because I don't want to be out of town without identification. All right, so second audible of the night. There's a two hour wait for bowling lanes. So we settled for some square mile cider outside on the patio. And uh, that's pretty wonderful. We're keen to get a piece of pizza at Sizzle, right Sizzle? Mm -hmm. Sizzle pie. pie. Down the street. <laughs> Can't even hear it over the other. Yeah, you can. <laughs> so much to do, so much to do. They don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. You miss your boyfriend, that little doggy? Yeah, Rambo. He loves you. He loves you so much, he started. He started doing, 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 It's tight, dog. It's tight. We're at Sizzle Pie. We're getting pizza to take back to the hotel. What are you forgetting? They didn't have one of yours. Did you get three? We got cider, t-shirts, and pizza. And it is crazy in here. I did, I have one. This is my t-shirt, we all got t-shirts. It's crazy in there, there's a huge line. They have amazing looking t-shirts, so we had to get them. But then we also had to order our pizzas, and it's like so much pressure, because it was a huge line, but I think we got it done. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! <laughs> I'm vlogging! <laughs> Shut the fuck up! <laughs> oh my god, Rob was getting so stressed. <laughs> so fucking stressed. That was intense. They don't they don't have that kind of stress in Australia. Uh, anyway, so we got our pies to take back to the hotel and we're drinking our sandwiches while we wait. Billion of you guys tweeted us about sizzle pie, so we've had to come here. And I'm excited. The pizza looks delicious. It's vegan and gluten free. And dope ass shirts. Tight. <laughs> fucking got you. Oh, there he is. Oh, there he is. Is he over there? Come this way. There he goes. He there he is, yeah. Right there. See him? All the way there. There he goes. 
Yo, this pizza is so good. What the fuck? This is the biggest pizza I've ever had in my life. This is huge. She can vouch. I always get the largest size gluten free pizza. And it's always has. the same size. And it's always like this big. This is crazy. Julian only ever gets one choice. Sizzle pie. Fucking shout out for making a real size pizza for me. Thank you, dog. Sizzle pie, we bought your t shirts whether your pizza was good or bad. <laughs> But I think it, it came from just like, we had like a lot of, we would, we would have late night drunk discussions and it was really, really fun. <laughs> and sometimes we would live stream at, you know, freaking three in the morning or whatever and it was way too late and 10 people were watching and a couple people were like, hey, like I'd, I'd like to watch this, but you know, I have a job, so maybe, <laughs> maybe make it accessible. So, you know, the, the word podcast came to mind and we just, we thought that it would be a great way to uh, to share that that is wild so that's like part of the hill they just carved yeah. it wow yeah yeah there's the troll under the bridge Jessica. Hi, Dink fam. She's super What's dink. What's up? And she's amazing. She's taking care of us. <laughs> Thank Shout you. Out.